Hello everyone. Welcome to this tutorial video on searching for books using the catalog of the College of the Redwoods Library. We will start at the main website for College of the Redwoods, which is located at www.redwoods.edu. Scroll to the bottom of the page and look on the left side of the page for a green rectangle with the word library inside. Click here. This will take you to the home page for the library. Alternatively, you can click on the tab labeled Academics at the top of the home page and select Library from the drop-down menu under the Academic Information header. If you look in the middle of the page, you will notice a search bar that says Find Books and More. This tool will enable you to search the entire library catalog for books on various topics. You have the ability to search based on a couple of different criteria. If you click on the downward facing arrow next to Library Catalog, you can select one of the filters to search by. These include title, author, and subject. There are a couple of other search options available, but these are very specialized and may not be used as much as the three I already mentioned. We will now conduct a search. Let's say you are doing a search for books on earthquakes in California. You would type in California earthquakes into the search bar and then click on Go. Pressing enter on the keyboard won't work here. The data can sometimes take a few seconds to load, so please be patient. The page that comes up lists all of the results of your search. Depending on the number of items retrieved, the search results may appear on more than one page. Each page lists 50 search results. In the middle of the page, you will see the results generated by our search. These results each have an individual library record, which tells you several pieces of information, including the title, author name, and catalog number. The record begins with the title, which appears as a blue link, and ends with the words Add to Cart. You will notice that the records alternate background colors. Each record contains information in addition to what you see on the screen in front of you. The text in blue is the title of the item. The information listed below the link will include the names of the authors, publisher, and year of publication. Before we click on the title, Notice that the words that you used in your search are highlighted in yellow. Near the bottom of the listing are two items listed in green text. The availability refers to the location of the item, how many copies of that item the library possesses, and whether it can be checked out or not. Some of the items may say reference. In this case, the book can be loaned to you, but you will not be able to take it out of the library. The other item in green is the location of the item. This includes the call number, which is the number assigned to that item. Think of it like an address. The call number tells you where in the library the item you are seeking is located. On the left side of the results page are several items in black and blue text. These are filters that you can use to narrow down your search results. One of the key filters is listed at the top of this column and reads, Limit to currently available items. Clicking on this filter will only show items that are ready for you to check out. Another filter that may be of use to you is the Topics filter, which lists terms similar to what you entered into your search. In addition to the filters on the left side of the results page, you have the option to arrange your search results based on a few different criteria. On the top right side of the page is a drop-down tab with the word Relevance. If you click on the downward facing arrow, you can organize your results in a couple of ways. You may, for example, arrange the search results with the newest items listed first, or you can arrange the results in alphabetical order based on the title. There are other options as well, so feel free to explore and choose the option that best suits your needs. Some of the search results might be electronic books or ebooks. This can be determined by looking for the word online in green next to where it says availability. These items do not have a physical location. In order to access ebooks, click on the text in light blue that reads, click here to read the ebook. You will then be taken to a web page where you can access the ebook. This will conclude our video on searching for books using the CR Library catalog. We hope you have found this information useful. Please contact the College of the Redwoods Library if you have any questions or need additional information.